Oh, that part you need to click. Ah, oh, it is good to be back. Welcome, everyone, to Quality Time. It's been the first in quite a while, because uh, internet and moving and idiocy, abundance abounds. Uh, so, firstly, thank you to Pen Doodlesbury, formerly penned out on Tumblr, for the brand new Quality Time logo. Looks pretty spiffy, if I dare say. Let's see, what is on the news? Well, we finally got high-speed internet here, so... We've gone from having half of two connections to two full connections, only one of which is actually all that decent, but the other one works, so yeah. Um, which means I'm now actually able to return to full video output and full live stream output and all of the other wonderful things that I do in Sundry every month. So that means that there's going to be Undermine, there's going to be uh, more work on World of Madness, there's going to be a Team Fortress 2, there's going to be um, Midnight Streams, there's going to be Dungeons and Dragon Hats, there's going to be all sorts, all happily coming along for the rest of the month and onwards. Yay! There's also apparently a thing happening involving uh, a house and how it's like fixed. I can't recall. Hang on a second, I'll just go grab the fuzz for this. So, for people in the long distant future, far beyond the Ides of March, long, dis long beyond the crumbling of Big Ben and the presumed dismemberment and like quartering of David Cameron, um, what exactly is a homestuck fuzz? Okay, you, you you are a Homestuck? Yes, I'm a Homestuck. Okay, tell us about Homestuck. Let me tell you about Homestuck. Okay, I am not actually going to go into a full description. Homestuck is a webcomic, for those of you who don't know. And it is very, very long. Over 10,000 pages long. Seven years in Yes, seven years in the making. And it has just ended. And I, who has been reading Homestuck, for about five years. And I, who has never, ever, ever, ever read Homestuck. I, I am quite distressed by the fact that it is over. I kind of don't believe it is. It is difficult to believe, but <laughs> it has in fact ended. There is going to be an epilogue sometime in the future, uh, but yeah. for the most part it is the end. But as Homestuck is, it was very confusing. Yeah. Like, it was a cluster fudge, that's what it was. Delicious clusters of fudge. Mm. Speaking of delicious clusters of fudge, you're doing some streaming blends, aren't you? What does that have to do with fudge? I have no idea. Streaming. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> I am probably going to be doing slightly more live streaming in the near future because I do not have a stable source of income at the moment because I have suspended my university studies, so I'm no longer getting a maintenance grant. Which means I need to find some other source of income. I have done a couple of odd streams in the past, but I will probably try to hold a more regular schedule over the next few weeks. Uh, you'll be able to see me stream at twitch.tv slash fuzzcrumbit. I will also be posting, likely on Twitter and Tumblr, about any ideas or any potential times for live streaming. So if anyone has any ideas of what I could play, I already have a couple of ideas, but input is always appreciated. Now first, might that include such games as Viscera Cleanup Detail? It might do, where I might have a chill evening once a week with Sam just shooting the breeze. Wow, so you'll be doing live streams of Viscera Cleanup Detail on occasion with possibly Sam, aka Sassy Tail, aka Garion from the Sunless series? Might there be alcohol involved occasionally? But, lying stop. <laughs> we might do more tipsy time streams. We might play a more Heart of War Boyfriend. I might do Borderlands with some people. Who knows, I might even stream some World of Warcraft, since that game is my I, eternal game, addiction. Yeah, that's kind of consumed you for the past five months. Actually, not... that's consumed most of our internet connection for the past five months. That's... World of Warcraft has consumed me for the past three years. So, over at twitch.tv slash... Buzz Crumpet. You can find some fun streams with the local Nyan. Well, that was an interesting segment. Okay, so on to the schedule as always. So tomorrow we have uh, the Midnight Stories stream, because now I actually have a couple chapters of uh, Minecraft story mode to get through. Um, that will be at 11pm GMT, as usual, over at twitch.tv slash lyingabedmore. On Friday we return to Undermine at last, and this is before I have actually 
done a whole ton of repairs because things happen that I wasn't able to fix. Um, so we get to survey the carnage of what happens when the server admin is gone for the better part of a, like half a year. Uh, on Saturday we start up XCOM 2. I know a bunch of people have been interested in all of the XCOM that's been coming out because I made about 35 episodes of it while I was offline because it was like one of the few games I could actually still play. Um, but uh, yeah, I've been putting those out five a day to get through that big log so that we can get to playing XCOM 2. We also, of course, have the Dungeons & Dragons Hats stream. If you have not been to a Dungeons & Dragons Hats stream in a while, which is entirely likely because I've been online in a while, um, we are approaching the very end of the Cityscape campaign, which means that Ergun, Edgekirk, it's all going to go away, and we'll be starting a new campaign very soon. So if you are, like... If, you're, if you've fallen behind and you don't know who anyone is and what's going on anymore, don't worry. Very soon, the entire world is getting obliterated. So yay. And then on Sunday, we go back to World of Madness for Dungeon Maker, uh, where I have improved the Sly Farm. The, the Sly Farm? I don't even know what Sly is. The Slime Farm. Hopefully some degree I have... Like, I kind of maybe slightly lost where the temple is, so I kind of need to find that first, but yeah. Uh, hopefully I will have access to all the slime I need. And on Tuesday, we have a fairly quiet morning in Edgington, so, you know, nice to have a few quiet days. And of course, that evening we should also have, at 9pm over at Twitch.tv slash Night of Everyone, the Yog Dwarves stream. Uh, we had a bit of a weird glitch that is literally only happening to my, like, code for Yog Dwarves, uh, that prevented me from actually showing it, but hopefully it'll be working then, Flying and I are working furiously on that to fix it, uh, so you can catch that there. Wednesday, we have what I'm sure many people are expecting and highly waiting for, the return of Night of Fangs. No words on what the story for that one's going to be, but I'm sure you'll all enjoy it. Uh. And so, as I imbibe the uh, old brown gold, uh, lying answers. We only have one question this week, which is a little bit surprising, but understandable. So the questions here are drawn from the comments section of the preceding quality time. So consequently, if you have a question for me, leave it in the comments below, and I'll hopefully check it out next week. But our comment this week comes from Quinn Brown, asking, what is the origin of your username? So people want to know, where does lying in bedmon come from? And I've, I've answered this a fair few times, honestly. It's, it's not exactly like a unique question. It's not something that doesn't uh, avoid my notice. Um, very simply, I like to sleep. I like to sleep in. I like to lie in, in fact. And that's like one of my favorite things. If I have like nothing going on a day, I have very little reason to get out of bed, and I won't. Because I like it nice and comfy and cozy and warm, and there's usually a lot of plushies around me. Um, that dates back to like my childhood, so that's not exactly a newly developed trait. But what also dates back to my childhood is Digimon. So um, I think in around about the mid 90s, thereabouts, uh, Digimon had finally arrived on probably Fox Kids at that point, because geez, um, and it was the passable, I guess, English dub, but uh, the thing in Digimon is that there's a bunch of creatures called Digimon, convenient, and all of their names end in Mon, Gatamon, Biomon, Tentomon, like, everyone ends in Mon, short for monster, ostensibly. So I think I was signing up for Neopets. I was a kid, give me a break. Um, so I had to come up with my, like, username. And I... The first thing that popped into my head was, okay, here are two things I like. Combine them. Lying in bed. Digimon. Lying in bed, Mon. <laughs> so yes, I am... The weirdest of Digimon. And that's saying a lot, because I'm that serious. Ah, tamers for life, yo. And... <laughs> with that bizarre anecdote, I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you enjoy seeing me back on everything. It is good to be back. I'm enjoying being back to work already. I have so much to catch up on, and I shall catch you all next time.